ambush scene, which we shot over four nights, obviously things go very badly. I'm gonna search her up. When we meet him, Kunzi is on a job. Hijack and get the consignment and deliver it and get paid. The scene happens just on the border of South Africa in the Kruger National Park. We picked a location that is actually on the verge of the cliff to make it feel as dangerous as possible. We shot most of the scene on a steady cam, just to be right next to our characters and in the middle of the action. So it's the, the combination of this feeling of danger in the location itself and the darkness and the lights and the dust. It looks gorgeous. Where? Oh, the really? fucking diamonds! The hijack goes upside down and he takes his revolver and... <laughs> It's a tough pill for them uh, to swallow that he wasn't able to protect Lawrence. And that sort of becomes the first catalyst for the rest of his journey into the story. And then he has to take all of that and put it in a bottle and save who's left. When this happens, he's obviously caught off guard. But he doesn't expect that there'd be gaps in the intel for the job to go well. He's coming up against a special forces trained guy. And so now he's like, somebody's double crossing. When we arrived at the farm, I had to drive through quite a narrow gate. And Yuri came to me and he was like, it just looks too slow. I was like, do you want me to drive the truck faster? So I'm going straight for this gate and I'm watching the side and somehow I misjudged it. I'm a precision driver. Not. And I ripped the, f the gate of the farm off. And I looked to the side where Trix was sitting. She looked at me with these eyes like, I said to Steve, I'm so sorry, I hope you've got insurance. And he's like, it's fine. And that's definitely going in the cut. So I <laughs> hope it's in the cut. Now he's trying to work out who knew what was going on with Flea. I think also trying to figure out how much does she know. Flea. And then of course wakes up the next morning and she's not there and she's taken his gun. She has a pistol on me, Lourdes, to shoot us. It's in my name, to register. And she has it. And then that's the second big thing that kicks off his journey. That stunt you pulled on the road is going to cost you. My fee's now 20% of the consignment value. I think what informed that decision to smuggle the diamonds is that she's a self-made girl. It's a lot of money. She can get out of the country, and that's, it's a new life. The whole hijacking, that changes her whole attitude and her whole approach. She realizes the caliber of person that she's dealing with. We'll meet in three days. 